Welcome to Cafe Zoom. Today I'm going to mix different ingredients with melted butter to make really funky popcorn. Our first recipe was sent in by Steve M. of Clark, New Jersey. It's called taco popcorn. Melt a half a stick of butter in the microwave for about 45 seconds. Make sure you use a microwave safe bowl because you can't have metal in the microwave. So you pour your butter on top of the popcorn. Fizzles. And then you want to mix it around. And you kind of want to be careful because popcorn could go all over the place. Okay. Then you take some taco seasoning and you sprinkle it on the top. You can use just a little bit of taco seasoning if you don't want it to be too spicy and a lot if you want it to be really spicy. I don't really like spicy foods that much. So I'll just put a little. I like. Okay. Hmm. Kind of. I don't really eat tacos that much, but as far as I know, it kind of takes tastes like taco. I like it. Our next recipe was sent in by Lauren E. of Richardson, Texas. She calls it sugar and spice popcorn. Take your popcorn and your melted butter and you put a little sugar and cinnamon into the melted butter. You want to put, whoa, you want to put a little more sugar than you do cinnamon. Cinnamon. Whoa. Put too much cinnamon. <laughs> then you mix it around until the sugar dissolves a little. Okay. You pour it on top of the popcorn stuff. Uh oh. I didn't mix too well. That's okay. And you stir it up. Oh, oh. Okay. Uh. Oh, I like that. It's very sugary. I like sugar. Our last recipe was sent in by Kathleen S. of Concord, Massachusetts. It's called maple popcorn. Mix maple syrup and melted butter together. Put the maple syrup in, uh -oh. like that, stir it around. I like maple syrup too. You pour it on top of the popcorn and mix it around, of course. Okay. I like this one a lot. It tastes like caramel popcorn. And now you're all set for a night at the movies.